If you're not showing up for you, then what are you really doing? Yeah. did my hair did that yesterday so if you didn't check that video out i'm booked and busy this week and i love it for myself i don't really do a lot of maintenance vlog maintenance for me is just it's more like buying home decor stuff it's more like trying new foods and stuff like that i will say that i do incorporate that but as far as like getting this hair together the toes the the lashes and all that sometimes i just feel like it's a waste of money but i really need a reminder because you know, the mental hasn't really been so strong and on point so i feel like this will really make me feel and get back to her the nails we're gonna get the nails done not doing none of the regular nail salons i found this girl on instagram i'm gonna see what's up with her i have two ideas i don't know which one i want maybe you guys can help me pick it out before i do that i gotta soak them off because it just looks a whole hot mess i don't really want to go to her shop with my nails like this i'd rather just come and get a full set and then we could just do what we need to do after we get the nails done i'm probably gonna run to Sephora. I just want to see about some stuff. I'm going to get some goodies. Tomorrow I'm getting a wax. I'm getting this cat wax. Okay. I'm revisiting it. If you've been here for a while, tried it when I was in New York and it was just a total fail. People be like, the more you do it, the easier it gets. I'm tired of doing it. I'm tired of shaving. I'm tired of the snipping. I just need her to be, you know what I mean? For a longer period of time. Also going to get my lashes done. Fingers crossed because y'all already know. It's something about my lashes that just don't hold on to the lashes. Turn into a baddie. I need to get it together, okay? It's now or never. I'm gonna pin this hair up because I feel like it's gonna get frizzy and I'm not even trying to fall on me. Like, we need, we need us a new tripod because y'all keep sliding and I can't have y'all sliding. It's like 8 o'clock, my appointment's at 9.50. I don't know if I'm gonna get these off by then. I should have definitely took them off last night. I'm over here talking like I don't wanna be somewhere in about an hour. Hopefully, I can get these nails soaked off within an hour. I think so. I'm looking for my bowls to soak my nails in. Do not look underneath here. I have to organize this. It just got out of whack. My, I started to get in the habit of just throwing stuff underneath. I'm not going to use my good bowls, like my kitchenware, to put the acetone in. I know I had these. There you are. Come on, I almost left y'all. <laughs> check for the sprite and these under eye patches and then we're gonna get something to eat because i'm starving didn't eat breakfast my ribs is touching right now like my stomach needs food asap i love this this is actually one of my favorite scents but i've been hearing so many good things about this one so i think we're gonna try her i also have the body butter as well too this bum bum cream is the truth though y'all it is bomb I actually need some more of this. This is one of my favorite deep conditioners. I have the lip gloss from Summer Fridays, which is really good, but I want to try a different one. I want something with a little bit of a tint. Oh, they got a face oil. Mm. Let's go check the perfumes. I feel like I need a new scent. It's really bad. This is another one of my faves. I actually need another one because I ran out, so I'm going to get this one, but... Taking care of self means not overdoing it. I had to get this old day general. I had to. There was there's no ifs, ands, or buts about it. Heaven in a bottle, okay? So I was looking for some topical under eye patches. Girl, I need something to eat now because my ribs are touching. I'm about to get hangry. I don't want that to happen. It's between pizza, so like the spot where I like to get bacon, egg, and cheeses from, but it's like I can make that at home. I'm thinking I'm feeling something more like some Jamaican food. I googled this place called The Hummingbird. It's like 27 minutes from where I'm at right now, and I need something now. But then there's another spot that's only about 10 minutes. 
Shit just got real, things are getting intense now. We're gonna go on a little solo date. And usually I don't like to go on solo dates, but it's nice. We're gonna sit outside and, you know, enjoy the weather. Come on. I always feel weird when I go out places by myself. But I'm gonna practice doing better. Because practice makes perfect. This looks smaller than I thought. Sometimes the pictures look bigger than what the actual item is, and I hate that. How cute this vase is. It's an actual, like, book. I just thought it was so aesthetic and so different. I had to get it. Because I was talking about getting a new vase, but... And I saw this, and I was like, how different is this? They also have it in, like, a clear color, but I thought black would just be great for the theme in the house. I didn't bring you guys when I went to Trader Joe's. I just wanted to check to see if they had any tulips in, but they have like the little tiny ones that are just starting to grow. So I found these at Harris Teeter for four bucks. Tell me that's not a message, y'all. I feel like this is a perfect amount of tulips for this. Oh my God, y'all about to die on me. Don't die yet. Don't die yet. Did they give me flower food? They didn't. Hurry up and do this for the day when battery dies. Oh, I feel like these are not. Let me see. Oh, I might have to cut those, but let me see. Because that's like over. I might have to cut this. Is it okay that they lean? Cause you know me, I cut all these Diego things off. They lean with it and rocking with it. I don't know if that's how it's supposed to go. Cause when I stand them up, it don't look right. Maybe I need more. Either way, I love this vase. It's so different. I'm thinking I'll put it on the island, but we are gonna have to fix this arrangement. Cause I don't know. I think it's these, the outer leaves that are making it like lean. Is it supposed to just be laying tilted to the side? Let me know y'all. Y'all know me and plants just don't work, but I'm gonna continuously try until I find the right plant that I can love on and it can thrive. If you guys are interested, I will link it at my Amazon storefront so you can get it in the description. They also have different colors and different styles. Good morning, guys. So this is day two of the transformation, okay? Self-care maintenance. I have a 10 o'clock eyelash appointment, but I wanted to hurry up and put something on my stomach. So I just ate some oatmeal and I made some toast. I also have a one o'clock appointment today to get this, the cat wax. Not really anticipating it, but in between that, I want to get my toes done because I still have white French tip on and that just doesn't go with the nails. It's not going with the aesthetic. Um, but yeah, it just feels weird to focus on me for like two days in a row, it's just like all about me. You know what I mean? I'm also recording on my phone because only me went and charged my camera last night when I went to sleep or my phone. Y'all want like 10%. I um, just wanted to start the vlog off and tell you guys what I'm doing right now. I hope I can record in there. If I can't, you guys gonna see the lashes after. This is the bare face right now with the bonnet on because last time I got my lashes done, it was so uncomfortable and my hair was like in a ponytail. So we're gonna be comfortable and cozy. We got the Adidas tracksuit on and it's a, it's a whole process. So who is this woman right now? Pull up to Full Lion real quick cause I'm starving. Yeah, I think my lashes came out beautiful. I got the cat eye set. I was gonna do wispy, but I'm treading lightly because I'm very basic. When you have that light, you don't need to do too much, okay? Mm -hmm. What I love the most about when I get my lashes done, which is not frequently, you don't even need to put makeup on. Like, it just gives you that beat look. All you need is some lip gloss and you are already already activated. 10 out of 10 recommend. The nails done, we got the lashes done. Next is gonna be the toes. And then lastly is gonna be the wax. Get like a yogurt or something, cause I'm really hungry. I don't wanna just keep running on empty stomach, but I'm thinking if I should call my appointment or should I? Just walk in. Usually when you get pedicures, you're pretty good. This is one nail tech. She's really good with the pedicure. So I don't know. Either way, I will see you guys when I get to my nail appointment.
no-go once again. The ambiance in there was amazing. She was so sweet, like loved her. First strip, I was like, no. No, no, no. Please talk me through it. Okay, I got you. Okay, women do this every day. I do this to myself. Deep breath. You said that didn't hurt. It did. Oh, oh my God. Oh my God. I'm ready. Relax your legs. Oh God, this isn't going to work. Just relax. Just relax. Deep breath. Okay. No, oh, I can't. Like, I can't. You can't. Let me get this off of you. Y'all, I can't so do much. this. I'm leaving. You're gonna leave with one. Yes, I this is where I messed up. At. She told me that I shaved too soon. The hairs were too short, and when they're too short, it like pulls more because she doesn't have anything to grip. Baby, when it, I was, I want to run up out that chair. Like if she wasn't so sweet and so cute, I would have kicked her. Gotta be like a different type of breed to tolerate that pain. Now I didn't have three kids, three babies, natural, no epidural, nothing pushed them up. Tattoos, piercings, all of the crazy nonsense. You know, I went through that phase and then I was able to like take it like a G. This, I can't. Like, I don't know what it is. The pain is just, I guess it's because it's so sensitive. She told me laser hurts too. What we're going to do for now, I have half a cat done and the other side, she just chilling. It's all right. We're not in mixed company, so it's okay. Only I know how she looks. She was like, no, it gets easier over time. Just book with me again. She didn't even charge me because I didn't go through with it. But she said to come back in three weeks and... Just don't shave, like don't shave at all because that will make it much easier for her to just like rip it and go. For now, we gonna beat it or near it because waxing it, ain't it ain't cutting it. I wanted to give you guys a close up of my feet. I love the way my feet came out. They go perfect with my nails. If it wants to focus, it's focusing on my feet. But like the nails, I think black is really nice. Just as much as the white French. I've gotta touch the hair because it's getting a little frizzy and look a little raggedy. Tomorrow we're gonna get dressed. That's what we're gonna do. Cause I didn't really show you guys like the full, you know, we got we got a little necessity. So now we gotta get dressed and I'm gonna take an Instagram picture tomorrow. But um honestly bro, I just go to bed. If I gotta cook some dinner, I'm gonna whip up some tacos real quick. And then I also wanna make this drink that I saw on TikTok. It's like a sleepy girl mocktail, so I'm gonna put you guys onto it. Perfect to spray her. refresh my hair i'm not gonna do too much to it but like when it starts to get dry you can tell so all i really do when i refresh my hair because i don't want to disturb the curls too much what i'm gonna really do is spray some water on it i, I gotta keep my spray bottle out but all i do is just wet it some i have product still in my hair i'm gonna add a little bit more gel and some leave-in conditioner just to you know make it look brand new because i don't want to go through the whole process again so all you do is just wet it some and then you just, I don't saturate it, saturate it, but I just dampen it some. I just add some more gel to the places that I feel like are more frizzier than others. I don't mind a little frizz though, so that doesn't really bother me. I like the definition, so that's why I'm not going to like play with it too much. And really the front, because I was sweating in the front. So wherever the parts are like, you know, frizzy and they look like they need some moisture, that's where you just go and add a little bit of moisture. I find that when I do a wash and go, this side looks better on me. Like everybody has like a certain um, style that fits the frame of their face. And I feel like when I flip my hair to the left, it looks better. Than, does the right side look better than the left? I don't know. I just like when my hair slips to the side. I don't really like when my hair is down the middle. I don't know. I'm gonna pin my hair up tomorrow. We'll figure out a cute style tomorrow. Cause I don't think I want to wear it completely down, but behind the ear that's kind of cute a little bit behind the ear i should pick it out that's what it is yeah okay it's simple we're not gonna sit here and do this all day y'all because i'm tired but you get the gist of it when you want to refresh your wash and go and hold you off until wash day just get a spray bottle you can even add some oils to your spray bottle and then just spritz your hair don't saturate it don't like make it too too wet a little bit of your styling creams or whatever and then that's it. You'll be able to get a few more days out of it. And, you know, you will be able to stretch it into wash day. Because who feels like going back in, rewashing your hair, and styling again? You're going to work smarter, not harder, ladies. She's done. Of course, I'll do my edges, but I'm not going to do my edges tonight, right now, because soon I'll be going in bed. Because this is how you stretch the hair. Especially if your hair is a little on the shorter side. You know shrinkage is real. It's respectful. 
try this method or even the banding method that takes a little longer and you need a hell of a lot of scrunchies so that's why i just do this this is much easier i pull my hair and i bring it in this little big old bun if your hair is like shorter you don't have to do a bun just bring your hair to the top and just let it hang out like a you know like a puff and then just put your your bonnet on my edges they usually stay intact because that got to be glue i literally go to sleep i'll sweat like I said, I was sweating today. I'll take a shower with all the steam, go to sleep, toss and turn, have the wildest dreams, wake up, and these edges are still like laid and slayed. Forgot to do my lashes. She said to just, you know, brush them out, wash them as regular. So far, so good, because usually when I get my lashes done, they fall out. Like, they don't last. I just wish that you could get more time than two weeks. I wish that they last for like a month, but I'm gonna try to stretch them to like at least two and a half, three weeks. Cause baby, these is not cheap. I don't mind it, treating myself every so often cause they're so pretty. I don't have to wake up tomorrow and put on like my mascara on. I don't wear my mascara, I just feel dead. It's something about when you get your eyes done or put makeup on or even a little bit of blush or just like, um, what is that shit called on top of your eyes? Eyeshadow, it just makes your face, you know, it makes your face pop. So we have some Lakewood. Pure tart cherry juice, never had cherry juice, not a big fan of it. And I chose to go with the Raspberry Rose or Rose Poppy. I really love this brand. It's really good. It's supposed to be better than actual soda. They have this and they also have the um, Olipop. But you can choose any type of carbonation you want. And people use this like inflammation type of powder. I was a little iffy about the inflammation powder because the cherry juice in itself is supposed to be good for inflammation. It's supposed to help you go to sleep, so... Let's see what it does. Everything I drink has to be cold, like cold, cold. I feel like when it's not cold, you don't really taste it good enough. Like you don't get the full effect. Shit, I'm making a mess. I'm trying to make it aesthetic for y'all. I'm over here making a mess. It's sticking to my fingers. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna do half cherry and then half. I'm gonna wash this top off. Wait, do you guys wash your top off before you drink any type of soda? Mix this. It looks like a Bloody Mary, don't it? And I don't even know what that is, because I don't even drink what I'm talking about. Cheers. That's good. That's good. It's very refreshing. I need to mix it because I want to try the cherry. I never... Never had cherry before. Never had cherry juice, cherry anything. I lean more towards the strawberry side. I'm going to mix it and see. Okay, there we go. Oh, that's sour. Real tart. You know what it tastes like? It's giving prune juice. Oh, God, no. I'm reliving my childhood. Yeah, I know what prune juice used to do back in the days. My grandma used to give me prune juice when I couldn't use the bathroom. It tastes like prune juice. Very tart. My mama drank it though. It's supposed to help you really sleep good, so. Drink up. I didn't want to close the vlog out without showing you guys the next day when I finally look like something all together. But yeah, this is this is the look that I'm going for today. I was going to wear like a cute dress, but the weather is just not permitting. Let's get into the top. It's so cute. It's a little orange, little crop top from Shein. And I'm on these Army Fatigue cargos. Oh, look at look at the six pack. I love these cargos. I got them from, believe it or not, I think I got these from Walmart. I'm not even going to lie. I think it was Walmart. And then I just threw on my dunks. I like these because of the little orange strip. I feel like it just makes the outfit pop. I don't really know what I'm going to do. It's almost 2 o'clock. I don't really have any plans today, but I want to go outside because when I look cute, I'll be like, I'm going outside. I'm not wasting a cute outfit just to stay inside. So I'll be thinking maybe I'll try tropical smoothie or if I don't do tropical smoothie, I'll probably just get an acai bowl because I love, love, love. I love me an acai bowl. So I just want to go outside and just get some air or whatever and then like do something because I feel like I look like a little snack and when you look good you feel good it makes a good day you have good energy you're thinking positive it's really just good for the soul if you have not done a maintenance vlog in a while I highly recommend it it does not mean that you need to spend $500 on a maintenance vlog not me continuously telling y'all to do a maintenance vlog y'all know what I meant I meant maintenance in general 
It can be a low maintenance blog. It could be things that you get from the dollar store, you know, and you can do it at home. You don't necessarily have to go to different businesses and get services. Sometimes life will throw you curveballs and life will make you forget all of the things that you once appreciated. And that's what I had to remember and remind myself. You know, It's always a work in progress for me when it comes to these type of videos and even off camera. I don't do much for myself. It's always me giving and pouring into other people, trying to like beat it in my head that I cannot be good to anybody else if I'm not good to me first. So this was just a quick little reminder and also it picked me up. You know, this was a little bit of a reality check to, to not forget about me and not feel guilty when I do spend extra money on me and not for anybody else you know what i mean you have to find that balance for yourself i'm gonna close the vlog out here if you enjoyed this vlog please give it a, give it a thumbs up it's for the free just if you can't watch it you didn't watch all the way through just just give it a thumbs up because it helps support is free right it helps me and makes me feel like i'm doing something right so and i also would love it if you subscribed if you didn't subscribe yet i love you guys and thank you for hanging out with me and coming with me to all my appointments i said i will see you guys in my next upload simply share simply share oh.